Well, I'm always on the lookout for a theme to write about, something that will hopefully help people through situations or help them with something in their life and give them hope and a purpose. And I got this word that came to my mind. It was time. I thought, well, you know, what can I write about time? Um, but when it when the word comes to your mind, it it flashes all the time. Every time you see the word, I see every time you see the word time, you think, you know, you got this uh, neon sign in your mind saying time, time, time. So I decided to write a post on time. The fact that people have limited days given to them. Time is a gift, but it's it's a limited quantity of a gift. And you need to take the time you have and let it be impactful to someone, to your young one, even to your old one, like, like my mother, who's almost 90, like my grandkids, who range in age from three to blah, blah, blah. <laughs> and, uh, and so impacting them with the time I have is uh, crucial. Well, it's hard to pick because I gave a lot of good... <laughs> I don't mean to sound conceited, but of course Jesus laid those on my heart. So there's a lot of good steps, but your purpose has to be on purpose. Your purpose has to be what you're passionate about. And, uh, and that will impact your time on earth and the time of those around you and the time of the community that will impact a lot of people. Time is the most valuable asset you have. So take the time to invest it well. If you plant in your young one, take the time like a farmer does, take the time to, to plant the seeds and to tend them and to nourish them and, and to weed them and to water them. That's how you get a good harvest. Time is your best investment. And I did, I did talk a little in the article about my son who passed away in 2014 in a car accident. And uh, time for him changed then. He went from minute to minute to glory to glory. And he's now living in glory where there is no time. And that's hard for us to comprehend, but um, time for me changed when he died also because it was very difficult. It was, it's like time stood still. And I had to um, practice some of these steps to go forward and find hope and healing. Time can be a precious gift, but it also can be painful. If, you're, if someone's dying or um, they're terminal, it's that time is a very painful time, but you can still impact those people and impact the people that are around you and impact yourself. Just never give up, keep going. You will get through it. Time is your most valuable asset. So invest it well and you will have a harvest of uh, incredible proportions.